I'm Joe Davis, the Apparatus Director for NAFCO. I'm here today to talk to you a little bit about the Rosenbauer mid-mount aerial that we have behind me. I'm going to start out talking about the chassis. I'm going to move on and talk about the body and then finish up with our aerial features that separate Rosenbauer from our competition. When we talk about Rosenbauer's custom chassis, we're truly talking about a custom chassis that can be configured in any way that fits the firefighter's needs. Specific to this truck, we have a 60-inch long cab with an 11-inch raised roof. There's seating for six SCBA seats inside the cab, and it's powered by a Cummins X15 605 horsepower motor. Another thing that I like to point out with Rosenbauer that's a safety feature is that we only use 316 aluminum skins and extrusions in our cab construction. That provides a quieter cab and a much safer cab for the end user. This truck has an EXT extruded aluminum body. That body has a lifetime transferable warranty for the entire life of the truck while it's on the road. That's made possible by the extrusions that we use to create an exoskeleton. Slightly different than a formed aluminum body where we are forming compartments and using each compartment to create this structure behind the body. This body is designed with a skeletal extrusion and the compartment walls are simply there as walls to hold in your equipment. This provides a true door opening. If we say that there's a 35 inch door opening, you can fit a 35 inch piece of equipment into that compartment and remove it. We also use the extrusions to house a lot of utilities, whether that's fuses, wiring, or drains, as well as any of the outlets or additional provisions that go into the compartment. This allows for the compartment to be maximized and used only for storage for the firefighter's equipment rather than utilities on the vehicle. Lastly, I'd like to talk about the Rosenbauer aerial. Our aerials are all hot dip galvanized. When I say that, I'm referring to the outriggers, the torque box, and the aerial ladder sections themselves. This is a crucial feature to provide a long-lasting vehicle for the firefighter. That hot dip galvanizing is not only an external coating, but is an internal coating also. That protects the inside of the steel tubing and allows for it to be resistant to corrosion that might happen due to condensation buildup inside of those steel tubes. As you know, in the southeast, we deal with high humidity temperatures, and that is what causes the condensation. Rosenbauer is the only provider in the industry that can provide a, a hot dip galvanized aerial. Rosenbauer also has an electric over hydraulic operating system that we refer to as a smart aerial. There's many great features of the smart aerial that focus on the firefighters' ability to do their job and focus on fighting fire rather than operating a piece of heavy equipment. The smart aerial comes standard with a single joystick control that controls all three functions of the aerial. This gives a free hand for microphone use or anything else that you might have to do on the scene. It also allows us to keep our eyes focused on the operating area rather than at the controls. The number one feature that we like to point out with our smart aerial is the ability to short jack and operate over the short jack side of the aerial. As you'll see here, we're set up with about 50% extension on our outriggers and we still have the aerial ladder swung over that side and we have a safe operating area. The way that we do that is by restricting one function to allow for safety and that function is your horizontal reach. So when we're operating on a short jack side of the truck, we can still operate safely to the extent of the horizontal reach limit that is set by the vehicle. This allows for soft touch controls as well, meaning the electric over hydraulic valve, if we were just to release the control completely, doesn't slam the valve shut and it slowly drifts to a stop, providing for a safer operating environment for anybody who's on the tip of that ladder. Finally, I like to point out what is commonly referred to as the favorite function of our smart aerial, and that is the ability to automatically bed the aerial, stow it into its cradle, and raise outriggers all at once, ensuring that the vehicle is not damaged after a long fire scene when we go to stow the aerial. Thank you for joining me today. If you guys have any questions following this video, please reach out to your local NAFCO representative, and they'll be happy to serve you.